Well, as the fall semester rolls on for colleges, they're keeping track of their COVID-19 cases because in New York State, a certain number could mean that all classes there move online. Join your side's Kelly Dudzik joining us now with a warning from the governor today that includes two Western New York campuses. Kelly. Hi, Kate. The governor said today that colleges are a problem and will continue to be a problem. He specifically called out UB and Fredonia at UB. As of this afternoon, there were two employees who have COVID-19 and 58 students who tested positive living on campus. And at Fredonia, there were 73 active cases in the student population, mostly off campus. Governor Andrew Cuomo says college students coming to New York from other countries and from the travel advisory states are going out and partying, spreading. COVID-19. We have a problem, SUNY Oneonta, Cornell, Buffalo, Hofstra, as we go, Colgate, Fredonia. That's all across the state. That's the entire state. That goes from Long Island all through upstate. So this is going to be a problem. I am telling you that. One of the lessons we learned is uh, just anticipate what's happening and be ready for it. That's why the governor said again today that any campus that hits 100 COVID-19 cases or more in a two week period would likely have to go to all remote learning. He says 100 cases can happen really easily, so he's anticipating this happening here in New York State. Coming up new first at five, we'll have information for parents about the new COVID-19 dashboards the state's now requiring every school district to have to monitor positive cases. The state will be running that website. The colleges already have dashboards and now pre-K through 12 schools are getting them, Kate. All right, Kelly, thank you. And the